It's an image that defines a crisis. A child crying as she and her family are detained by U.S. immigration officials after crossing the southern border. The photographer who took the shot says the child was traveling with her mother for a month after fleeing Honduras. When they went to body search her uh, against the vehicle, they asked her to put down her child. Mm. And right then, in that moment, uh, the little girl uh, broke into tears. Uh, and, uh, you know, it's not unusual for toddlers in any circumstance to have separation anxiety. Mm -hmm. But I think this particular situation with the separation of families leads uh, and gives a new meaning to that phrase. John Moore says he has covered migrants crossing the border in the past, but this time was different. Since some of these families had been traveling in such difficult conditions, they weren't aware that parents and children would be detained separately while their cases are processed. And for me to take these pictures, scenes that I'd seen before, but with the knowledge that these parents and their children would soon be in separate detention facilities, uh, made it hard for me personally as a, as a journalist, as a human being, and, and especially as a father. It's a policy that some officials in the Trump administration deny is being practiced, though images from detention facilities and interviews with parents prove otherwise. Humanitarian organizations are calling for it to end, saying it is cruel and will traumatize the children. For InsideEdition.com, I'm Mara Matsulbano.